Question three is a flaw slash descriptive weakening question argument. Most vulnerable to criticism on the grounds that it has done something right. It has done something terrible. So sunscreen lotions, and in case you didn't know what sunscreen lotions were,、uh, they're designed to block skin cancer causing UV radiation. Okay, all right. So now we all know what sunscreen lotions are. They do not do so effectively. Really? Huh? Why? Right, like this is the conclusion because I, I I mean I read this and like that's I mean you have to try to convince me of this right and these are going to be the premises. Many scientific studies have shown that people who have consistently used these lotions right these lotion referential sunscreen lotions develop on average as many skin cancers as those who have rarely have ever used them. Well, that doesn't show. How does that prove anything? I mean, like th- think about who uses sunscreen lotions right. This question is. Um, you know, it's incredibly cookie cutter. I I actually can't shake the feeling that I I know it's not possible, but I can't shake the feeling that I've actually seen this exact question before.、Um, but yeah, like that's that's got to be why, right? People who use sunscreen lotion get skin cancer at about the same rate as people who don't. It's probably because people who use sunscreen lotion are in the sun a lot. People who don't are live in a cave or something. It takes for granted that there are no other possible health benefits of using sun. Nobody nobody's talking about other possible health benefits. Right, like I mean, that's all great and stuff, but it's just it's entirely irrelevant to this argument. You know, if say it just so happens that using sunscreen also makes you smell like a rose, right?、Oh, that's awesome. I mean, if you want to smell like a rose, that's awesome. But that's entirely irrelevant to this argument. Fell distinguish between the relative number of cases and the severity of those cases. True, right? I mean, this charge levied against the argument is true. The argument indeed has failed to distinguish between how many cases versus the severity of those cases, right? But that's also not relevant to the argument.、Right? The reason why this premise does not support this conclusion is not because they didn't talk about. It's not because this argument did not talk about the distinction between number and severity. Right? It's for some other reason that we already discussed. Fels consider、uh, the effectiveness of lotions that are not specifically designed to block. Yeah, that's also a true. The argument also doesn't consider this. It also doesn't consider cat food. Like, what, what do you want? Right? Th- th- we're talking about sunscreen lotions, which are designed to block. Right? This thing、uh, relies on evidence regarding the probability of people in different groups developing cancer that, in principle, would be impossible to challenge. What are you talking about? Why is this in- in- impossible to challenge? Just ask the studies where you got your data from and challenge it. Right, easy right answer. Overlooks the possibility people who consistently use sunscreen spend more time in sun on average than people who don't. Right, that explains why they get as many、uh, sun. This is like exactly. I don't know. There's so many、uh, questions that this one's like.、Uh, I am、uh, once again reminded of the、uh, seasickness dramamine question, where you know, like, who takes dramamine? Who uses sunscreen? People who are prone to seasick. People who spend a lot of time in the sun. Right, it's the same question.